So this is my deep freezer that I have. I'll put the size down below. Um, I just noticed that like when I'm getting ready to cook or my husband's getting ready to cook, it's just difficult to figure out what we have as far as vegetables and meats and things like that. So you gotta like dig all in there and take stuff out. And I just didn't wanna go through that. So of course, as you know, I was watching organization kitchen videos and I found a young lady I'll try to put her information down below who had a deep freezer um, and she used these recycling bins that I got from the container store um, so I was like that is a good idea let me use that it has handles so that it's easy to take out and put back in so that's what I'm using here and um, I'll just let the video speak for itself going to get shoebox containers from container store but I realized that I could go to Walmart it was a little bit cheaper so we're all about saving so that's what I did I got some Sterilite seven quart shoe boxes um, they work perfectly for my meats um, I don't really eat a lot of meat that often or even every single day so just have that on the side there. Um, it fits perfectly, so that's what I would recommend for you to get if you have a size deep freezer like mine. I also use the second shoe box for leftover fruits, like the fruit bags are a little bit smaller, that could fit, so that was perfect. Put that right in the freezer, and I was ready to go. same size as mine so initially I had gotten four of the recyclable bins but I only needed two so just make sure that you don't get you know more but the container store of course was able to refund me my money for the other two that I didn't need but just make sure that you're getting the right amount for your freezer size 